Hello and welcome to our second Kamen Rider XA toy review. This is the DX Kimewaza slot holder and Oxo Bike Gashato. So there is a Rider Gashato included in this set and it is the Boxo Bike which is the main transformation Gashato for Kamen Rider Laser which we have seen in the series already by the time of this recording. If you haven't seen it yet, please go check out the series. Okay. Now, we'll focus on the Rider Gashato first. So I'll set the parts for the Kimi was a slot holder to the side because I like to focus on the main collectible first in my reviews. So the Paxo bike is essentially a repaint of your Mighty Action X. It's just with some different detailing over it as well as made in a different color but it's essentially the same thing and it would be the same for most of your other Rider Gashato as we go down the line I mean there will be some exceptions to that rule but they will generally be the same now the Rider Gashato all work on a two button press system so So the same fare as your Mighty Action X and as previously, I will turn off the lights to show off the LEDs from the toy. Alright. All right, let's get the lights back on. And now I'll bring in the DX Gamer Driver so we can show its functionality with that. So as always, we start with the DX Gamer Driver in its close position because that's how we get all the sounds. So we start with the transformation Right. Plug it into the first slot. And we get essentially the same transformation for the boxer bike as we did with Mighty Action X, but of course the LEDs are different and it shows from inside the DX Gamer Driver, which is a nice plus. Now for the level up, where we'll get some nice new transformation sounds. Not very nice, we can see the detail of the bike symbol inside the Gamer Driver. Which is cool. I mean, Kamen Rider Laser has a very weird design being a just a bike on its own rather than actually being a full rider. And we'll see how that plays out as the series goes along. I'm not exactly a big fan of it right now. But, well, what can I do, right? Now, I'll show off how the Boxo Bike Level 3 sound is like by plugging into the second slot. Now I can do a full level 3 transformation which I'll show off later on but I want you guys to be able to hear the full sounds first. So let's go. And that was the level 3 sound for the Boxer Bike Rider Gashato. Now let's do some good um, combinations with Mighty Action X. 
So um, I'll start by putting Buxo Bike into the left slot. Oops, that didn't work. It's not cooperating with me. Eh? Now I've noticed that the Rider Gashato do tend to give us a little bit of trouble whenever we plug it out and put it in multiple times. So if you guys are having the same problem, just pull it out, cycle through a few sounds. It should be okay after a while. Alright, so bring in the Mighty Action Axe. Oh nice. Alright. Mighty Action Axe! Alright, and I'll plug that into the second slot. And you'll see that this is how it looks like when you plug two Radica Shuttle together. And we can do a level 3 transformation. So now you can finally see how a level 3 would sound like and look like as well. You can see the display inside. And do notice, um, I did not point it out earlier, when I do the next transformation, do notice that both lights actually fade out at almost the same time, which is a cool detail that they put in. All right, now I'll switch out the two Radical Shuttle so you guys can see uh, how it sound like and look like with the Mighty Action X as the main transformation and the Buxo bike as the power up. Ah, see, so it's giving us trouble again. So press it. Right, let's do this. So once again, you see that the two designs have overlapped over each other. And yep, they fade away together as well. Now it's quite interesting to have more Radical Shuttle because right now we already have two different possibilities for level 3 just by having two Radical Shuttle already. So the more Radical Shuttle you have, the more play value you'll be able to get. Alright. So I think that's all for the DX Gamer Driver. Let me put him to the side. Alright. So let's move back to the Kimiwaza slot holder. So you can see that I have the two pieces that I showed off earlier. Now both of these are essentially the same toy. I'm not sure why they package them as two separate parts, but they are meant to be just one item. So to connect them, you see that there are packs on the orange piece and matching grooves on the main piece. So all you do is you just line the packs to the grooves, slot it in and with quite a bit of pushing, you need to apply quite a bit of force on this. You should be able to get it to line up nicely and hold in place. And you will have a complete toy. Now the orange part is for where your Rider Gashato would slot into. So our two Rider Gashato, we have the Luxo bike. Alright, can pack it in. And we have our Mighty Action X. And I can pack that in as well. 
and so they will stay in pretty well. Now they do not actually lock in anywhere, they just held in by a tight fit. So if you try to hold them upside down and shake vigorously, they'll probably fall out, but you're not supposed to have it upside down anyway, so that shouldn't be a problem. Now there is obviously a hook on the main body as well, and that is to hold it to the DX gamer driver. I have the strap piece here, not the full gamer driver. Okay, so just clip in place, it will hold there pretty nicely. Now it's not a perfect fit, you'll see that it doesn't go all the way down to the end, so it doesn't actually clip in place, but it just hold quite well, again, by friction, just like the Radica Chateau. So keep that in mind, it doesn't lock in anywhere at all, just, it just holds there fairly tightly. So shouldn't be a problem for the most casual play, don't do somersaults with it and all if you guys have any intention of doing that. But yep, so there is obviously one other slot on the top of the Kimiwaza slot holder. Now that is not for storing your Radica Shuttle, that actually has another play value. And that's what's really cool about this, all right? This allows you to unlock the finishing attack for your Radica Shuttle. So after you play with it with the transformation sounds for your DX Gamer Driver, you have a level up sounds. Here we have the finisher. Kind of like what you had with the double driver where you had the maximum drive slot on the side. So this serves that purpose as well. So we'll start with the Buxo bike. So just plug it in. And you say the shutter. Now I push the button once to start the standby sound for the final attack and another press would activate the actual sound effects. So standby sound. You can see LEDs inside there. Alright. Now one more press, we'll get the finishing attack. Alright, so that's the critical strike, alright? Now this sound is only unlockable through the Kimiwaza slot holder or if you mess around with the buttons on the Radical Shuttle but otherwise there are no toys other than this one that unlocks the critical strike. Now there is also another finishing move that you can unlock with the DX um, Dashakon weapon series. Now I cannot show that off yet but for now, this item is the only way for you to get the critical strike and that is kind of a shame because if you think about it, this item doesn't come with the main belt, it doesn't come with the main transformation device. So you cannot get the final attack unless you buy this slot holder. Not that people would mind buying it because, I mean, I bought it primarily for the Buxo bike Radical Shuttle. I, I ordered this without actually thinking about the final attack. but. It's kind of a shame if you actually did that and if you're like, hey, I don't really like coming around the laser or something, but I want to do the final attack and I still cannot do it without buying this item. So, kind of a shame, but at the same time, it adds play value to the toy itself, so I'm not complaining. Okay, I can show off um, the Mighty Action X finishing attack as well. So, for the Mighty Action X. Alright. And that is the mighty critical strike. So again. If you just bought the Gamer Driver without buying this, your Mighty Action X would not be able to unlock the Mighty Critical Strike unless you messed around with the buttons on the side of the Radical Shuttle in the correct order. Otherwise, yep, this thing is pretty much a must-buy if you need those attack sounds. 
Now, there will be different sounds for the Gashakon weapons that are only unlockable by plugging in the Radica shuttle into those weapons. Unfortunately, I have no intention of buying any of those weapons as of now because none of them actually come with a Radica shuttle. This, I bought this primarily because it came with the Bakso bike Radica shuttle and I want to have all of the Radica shuttle or at least all of the main ones if possible. So unfortunately, until Bandai decides to package a DX Radica shuttle with a Gashakon weapon, otherwise I probably would have to skip out on the Gashakon weapon series entirely. Which is a real shame if you think about it, because I wouldn't be able to do the final attack. I might change my mind at some point in time if I find a weapon that I really want to get. But for now, we'll just have to deal with it as it is. Alright, so the next review would be for the DX Shakaliki Sports Gashato. Since I have all of the DX toys that I own currently unboxed already, so I can show off the sounds for this toy. So look forward to that review coming up soon. And that's all for this one. So now that's a wrap for the DX Kimiwaza slot holder and Bakso bike Gashato. If you're planning to buy into this toy line, highly recommend picking this up. It's not a must-have item, but considering you do get the final attack that you cannot get with the main transformation device, it is pretty good. It is pretty worth the money. It is kind of on the steep end of the price range, but you are getting a main Rider Gashato, so do keep that in mind. So that's all for this review and I'll see you next game.